Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about the flow of blood through the heart. The blood is important to the body because it helps to transport oxygen to the cells, remove carbon dioxide, it helps fight disease, delivers important nutrients, and several other functions that help keep us alive. The heart pumps the blood through the body with the help of veins and arteries. Let's take a look at the flow of blood through the body. Blood from the lower parts of the body enters the heart through the inferior vena cava and from the head and upper parts of the body through the superior vena cava. These two large veins empty into the right atrium. The blood then passes through the tricuspid valve and into the muscular right ventricle. The right ventricle contracts and sends the blood through the pulmonary valve and into the pulmonary arteries. These arteries lead to the lungs. In the lungs, carbon dioxide is exchanged for oxygen and the blood returns to the left side of the heart by way of the pulmonary veins. It enters the left atrium and then passes through the bicuspid valve and into the largest and strongest chamber of the heart, the left ventricle. When the left ventricle contracts, the blood is push, pushed through the aortic valve and into the aorta, which is the largest blood vessel in the body. The blood travels throughout the body and this cycle repeats itself. I hope that helps with understanding the flow of blood through the body. Thanks for watching and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.